was flipping my chicken and the screw. Oh, dang it. Just came out of the handle, so I'm gonna have to screw it back in. Hard times. So I'm gonna eat breakfast. Uh, I got some chicken and potatoes here, some oatmeal, and also some egg whites. But after breakfast, I wanna take you guys out to the track and I'm gonna show you some valuable, valuable information. All right, cool. What's your name? Josh. Josh, cool. All right, so I'm just gonna do some uh, like slow motion shots. So just do your little thing, and I'm gonna film you. All right. Cool. So I have my camera fixed on this soccer pole. So I hope it doesn't fall down. But I'm here to offer you guys some very important tips. Some of you have been asking me, how do I get better at my PFA or PRT, whether it be for the military, whether it be for if you're going into a um, police academy, or whether you just want to increase your push-ups, pull-ups, or your run, or your or your sit-ups, really. So uh, this method can be applied to anything, that, anything physical that you're trying to get better at, and it could probably be applied to mostly anything in your life. So uh, I know there are other videos out there that'll say increase your pull-ups, you know, by 30. In less than two minutes or increase your pull-ups by 400 percent in less than two days well this is not a get rich quick strategy it takes a little bit of work but this is guaranteed and it's universal for everyone it will work for everyone so uh, i'm very confident that whoever watches this video will be able to apply this method and be able to increase their pull-ups push-ups sit-ups or their run so when i first joined the military i didn't really struggle with push-ups but I wanted to increase them so this is a method that I applied and um, I increased my pull-ups my push-ups and my sit-ups and as well as my run now I wasn't taking PFAs or PRTs I was taking PSTs which includes a swim and I also did this with my swim too so chances are you won't be swimming if you are you can apply this too so the main method is based on your maximum so if you take uh, your maximum set of push-ups let's say in two minutes so you do push-ups for two minutes and your max set, so however many push-ups you get in two minutes, you divide it in half. And you take that number and you do it over the course of a week. So let's say if I could do 80 push-ups in two minutes, I would take 40 and I would do five sets of 40 every single day for one week, seven days. So five sets of your halfway mark is gonna be pretty easy. So let's say if you can do 40 push-ups, you take 20. Five sets of 20, that's 100 push-ups a day. So. I'm not the best explainer. Hopefully this is making sense to y'all. Second week, you'll bump it up by 10. So if I started with 40 for sets of five for my first week, you'll bump it up by 10 and do 50. Five sets of 50 through your second week. My camera keeps overheating in the sun, so I had to come in the shade and now there's a weird echo. So for example, if you can do eight pull-ups in two minutes, you're gonna cut that in half and do four. So you can do five sets of four each day. and week by week for three weeks you're gonna bump it up by one so for example if you can do eight pull-ups in two minutes you're gonna cut that in half and do four so you can do five sets of four each day and week by week for three weeks you're gonna bump it up by one so in short if you use this method I just taught you it's gonna increase your maxes from anywhere to 30 to 40 percent so guys I hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching as always be sure to subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you next time